this level 1.3 is the part that bothered me for years. And, uh, and we say, hey, look at number 13. How would you factor it? Now, my teacher would just show me and say, oh, yeah, if you factor it, you just do A plus B and then 5 minus X. Now, how many, how many of you don't feel comfortable with this? Okay, what makes you not comfortable? Everything, Everything right? Yeah, I felt the same way when I was doing this. I was like, wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, stop, 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 stop. Now, what I'm seeing is that the left-hand side has two of the A plus B, and how come on the right-hand side you only write it once? That makes no sense at all. But, 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 let's look at the pre, look, look, look up, look higher. Okay, just look a little bit higher. Can't you see that uh, you take out the common factor, like number seven? You took out the common factor, what, X, right? And then you just write down what's left inside the parentheses. Now, as I said, math is not just about your brain, it's about your vision. And if you find yourself feel, feeling uncomfortable, use a highlighter. Use a highlighter to highlight this part right here and right here. All right? So it's about seeing this, about seeing the obvious, but it may not be so easily understood. Now, what you're seeing is this. You're like, hey, what were we saying earlier? You take out the common factor, right? And if I ask you, hey, everybody, boys and girls, there are two terms right here. What is the common factor? Louder? A plus B. Can everyone see the common factor? A plus B. Yes or no? Yes? And therefore, since it's a common factor, we will take it out. It's factored. And what's left? 5 minus X. Years. Took me years to understand what's going on here. That you have a common factor, A plus B. It's longer. It's not as simple as what we saw earlier. Like earlier, it was nice, right? The earlier questions, like the common factor was just X, the Y. It's easy to spot out. It's a single letter. It was fine. But what about now? It's just a little bit longer, but it is still the same common factor. So that resolves my mystery of what's going on is to see what defines as a common factor. It may look more complicated, but it is still the same. So that's why on your paper, you can see that it's slightly bowed, right? The, the, the font. So what's the common factor here for number 14? We say, oh, let's go ahead and take out the X plus two. Okay. And then what's left? X minus five. Good. Everybody, good? Okay. Again, it took me years. So if you are getting it right now, ooh, you are way better than I did. All right. So I try to not having you to experience my pain, my tortured experience in the past. What's the common factor here? Okay. So now your eyes are getting better. Your eyes are getting really good. You're like, hey, I can see that. Like you are now being able to zoom out and say, hey, I see something in common. What's the common factor here? 2x minus 1, right? You say, oh, yeah, 2x minus 1. Now, this is how I kind of want to push up, like try to describe factoring. And everybody should be able to do factoring. The only people who cannot do factoring are the ones, that, are the ones who are lazy. Because if you go through this process, you learn how to see things. There is no way that you don't know how to factor. So the common factor here, x plus one, and then you have x squared minus four. How are you feeling so far? Good? Good, 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 good. all right. And, uh, and now we have the common, what's the common factor here? x squared minus one, all right? Now, now I'm asking you these questions. 
I hope that you are also asking these questions in your own mind. Now, one thing that makes math really better, easier for you is that make sure that you are consistently talking to yourself. And this does not restrict to just mathematics. It also applies to chemistry. It applies to physics. It applies to, you know, life in general. You should talk to yourself. You should really learn how to discuss things with yourself so that yourself will be like, oh, yeah, I can tell why we write something like these. Thumbs up if you feel good. Yes. Wonderful. 